Auto workers say they're worried about Biden's electric vehicle push. Ashley, come on in, please. Good morning to you. What else are they saying yeah. about it? Good morning. Well, the auto workers simply are worried about losing their jobs. In an interview with the New York Times, those auto workers in Michigan said that EV products need much less manpower to produce, leading to tens of thousands of jobs being lost. One worker said, quote, it's scary right now with the whole electric push. This electric stuff is going to kill, just kill thousands and thousands of jobs. Now, according to the Times, the Biden administration now rethinking its green car agenda and is planning to delay a requirement that auto companies quickly increase their sales of EVs in the next few years until after the year 2030. But not only have EV sales been in the tank, they're expensive to make. The average EV costs 52500 while the average subcompact car just around $24,000. And by the way, Ford alone projects a loss of five to five and a half billion dollars in its ED division this year, EV division uh, this year. So not only do they, uh, are they very expensive to make, but no one's buying them. Uh, that's true. true. Uh, I can just see the subsidies rolling into yeah. Detroit fairly soon. Ashley, thank you very much indeed. Yeah.